In this tutorial, we're going to use Visual Basic to program a Netduino to have the LED blink. So, I have a new project. It's called Blink, and I have already opened up the project properties. Under Micro Framework, I've made sure it's using the USB and it's looking at my Netduino device. And also, I've checked my references. I'm using version 4.2 of the framework right now, and that's uh, what's on my Netduino, so everything's good there. We're going to op open up this module here. <clears throat> All right, so we want the LED to blink on and off. So first, we're going to have to define the LED. So with v VB you have to dimension all of your variables. So we'll do a dim LED as, and it's going to be an output. So out, and I'm going to hit tab. Now that we have our LED, we can go ahead and set it up. It's going to be a new instance of out, Output port. By the way, this output port comes out of these uh, references here. And we're going to say, um, you wouldn't know this, uh, but you're just going to have to remember you have to type pins dot. Now we can select the Netduino hardware. Um, before we were doing that, it just had some raw .NET uh, framework pins, but we want the ones specific to Netduino. So we do a pins dot onboard LED, IntelliSense is telling us, hey, you need to put, to put a comma, and then our initial state's a bool. It's either true or false. So let's do false. All right, so we have our LED. We want to blink it on and off. So we're going to make a while loop. Uh, with VB, you just do a do. I'm just hitting a tab here because I agree with what it says. There we go, while tab. And I want a true enter. So. With these loops, what you would normally do, instead of true, you might say, hey, do while x um, equals uh, z. But, you know, we aren't evaluating. We just want this thing to go over and over and over. So we're going to say do while true. All right. So we're going to take our LED and we're going to do a dot and it gives us some options of what we can do to it. We're going to write to it and it says here the state oops LED dot write and there's a state as a bool. So let's do and it's in between parentheses here. Make sure you Don't forget that. LED dot right. And then our state's going to be true. All right. And then we're going to wait for a while and then we'll turn it off. So with um, dot net micro framework to do a delay, you do a thread. There's thread. I'm going to hit dot sleep. That's exactly what I want. All right. It says, hey, so we want milliseconds timeout as integer in here. So an integer doesn't have periods. We'll just do a thread dot sleep. Okay, so um, 1,000 milliseconds equals one second. So it's going to turn it on for one second. 
And then we're going to do, let's turn it off for a second. And it looks pretty happy. I uh, messed up that when I was explaining some things here. So we'll go ahead and save it, run it. It's going to deploy. We have a successful Netduino Blink application.